mouth and begin to pray. Show me your glory. Show me your glory Lord. Display your glory in my life. Let this life carry your glory. Masuka taya bakura nanandele gede. Ah, I need a higher level. Alalalabo shika na masoto korea hata. La prende le kina la vashina la huta ya hata haya. Rakande le katura anda le kataya mandolo. Redele Bosch Kataya Mako Rabasata. That is show me your glory. Oh, you could show me your glory. Aquaria, show me your glory. I'm a suit of the Bahotaya. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. Somebody lift up your voice in high praise and worship God in the spirit. Uh, worship Yahweh. Go ahead and worship the supremacy. Go ahead and worship the great I am, the first and last, the unchangeable changer. Come on, somebody, go ahead and worship. Ilakata libro konto liba kande lebo shinda. Labrede gebus kata le prananta lava shinda. You are Yahweh. Come on, somebody, lift up your voice and worship your way. Lift up your voice and worship the great I am. Worship him. Give him glory. Give him honor. Give him adoration for who is like unto thee, O God. Glorious in holiness. Fearful in praises. Doing wonders as you worship him, as you make him big. Every other thing fades away. Every other thing begins to fade. Can we just make him our focus this morning? Go ahead and make him our focus. Lord, we worship you. We adore you. We extol you. For who is like you unto to be your God? We worship your majesty. You are the great I am, the first and last. You are Yahweh Rafa. You are Yahweh Rafika. You are Yahweh Nisi. Lord, we worship you. Blessed be your holy name. God wants to boast in your life. God wants to tell the enemies. <laughs> Don't touch this one. Don't touch this one. She belongs to me. He belongs to me. I don't know who is that person watching me. That's what the Lord is saying concerning you. Ibu Afana, Omega,
Thursday prayer of the month of August. It is the month of new beginning. It's the month that God has prepared something for you. This is the month that God said, I will do a new thing. Do you not know it? He said, I will make rivers <laughs> ah, in the desert. <laughs> that means he's telling you that he will do the impossible. Child of God, will you enter this month and come out without a new thing? I want you to lift up your hands and just begin to worship the greater yet. La makoto le makaya basuka ramene le nebosha masaka taya makoro boshe kese nebo ine de de kalabra koto le makaya ndele gedeza somebody call on the God that can save you iye kele kete le prokoto le mo masaka ta rekete mo masika dale la prokoto raza gadele ma raka boshe kete le aha. Welcome your sister, welcome your brother. Tell somebody, join in, join in, share, share, share. Hallelujah. Masuka taya, kate lebra doli, makataya. Mande le gedias, kataya, boko riketeli, makayande. Razeketeli bahaya. Mashika taya mahandele. As you enter this month of August, as you have come for this Kairos time, it's a Kairos time. 12 noon today is a Kairos time. You know when you keep you know when we keep doing the same thing there's a portal that opens there and the portal has opened the lord is already waiting for some of you at 12 noon every thursday i tell you the truth it's an appointment for somebody i need you to remind your sister i need you to call your sister i need to call your brother i need you to call your father in the village tell him to join in because god is about to do something thank you jesus Daddy, we love you. We love you for what you want to do with us. Lift up your hands again. I feel the presence of the Lord so strong in this place. Go ahead and just worship him. Say, Lord, I am here. I am here, Lord. Have your way, Lord. Come and take absolute control of what is happening here, Lord. Jehovah, we need your move in this place right now. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Now, without wasting time, I would like us to pray. Today, what the Lord put in my heart to pray about, you know, someone had called me and talked about conspiracy. 
And as I began to pray, the Lord said, tell my people about conspiracy. Begin to break every conspiracy. I will tell you some secrets about conspiracy. But we're going to read the scriptures. First of all, I want us to read the book of Isaiah chapter 8 verse 12. Isaiah 8 12. The Bible says, do not call conspiracy all that these people call conspiracy. And do not fear what they fear, nor be in dread. God is telling you, don't be afraid of them. Don't be afraid of conspiracy. I came to tell somebody, do not be afraid whether they gang up against you. That is not your business. The Lord is going to fight for you. Amen. Don't be afraid about, of conspiracy. That's the first thing. So I want you to lift up your hands wherever you are and say, Father, Father I, will not fear their fear. I will not fear their fear in the name of in Jesus. Name of Go ahead Jesus. and begin to pray. Say, I will not fear. According to your instruction, according to your, your, your law, according to what you have said in your word, I will not fear their fear. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I don't care who conspires against me. I don't care who conspires against my husband. I don't care who conspires about my children. But today, Lord Jehovah God in heaven, I will not fear their conspiracy. For the Lord is with me. The Lord is with me. Somebody shout, he said, the Lord is with me. The Lord is with me. As a mighty, terrible one. Therefore, I will not be afraid. Thank you, Abba Father. In Jesus' name, we are praying. In the mighty name of Jesus. I want you to know more about conspiracy. If you open the book of Mark, chapter 3, verse 6, he said, the Pharisees went out and immediately held counsel with the Herodians against him how to destroy him. I don't know who is planning to destroy you, but the Bible says that when they came to arrest Jesus, he walked in their midst. I want you to begin to pray, Father, make me invisible to the enemy. Let me become invisible. When they come to destroy me, they will not find me. When they are looking for names, they will not see my name. When they are looking for names, they will not see my daughter's name. They will not see. When they are looking for people to destroy, they will not see my husband's name. In the name of Jesus, somebody delete your name from that demotion list. Any, any demotion list, they have written your name. I delete it in the name of Jesus. La prokoto seketelia rabaka tala makata yaha regedele makura bashika nana masaka taya mahande. They conspire to destroy him. They conspire to destroy your family. But today we decree that we have become invisible. We have become invisible. We have become invisible. We have become invisible. In Jesus' matchless name, we are praying. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. The Bible says in Psalm 83 verse 3, it said they lay crafty plans against your people. They consult together against your treasured ones. I want to say to you, you are very important to God. We are very important to God. I am very important to God. I know what the Bible says in Psalm 83 verse 3. It said they lay crafty plans against your people. They consult together against your treasured ones. Crafty plans. I don't know who is doing some crafty things. There are some people planning some evil things, playing some kind of wayo just to trap you like a fowler. The Bible talks about the fowler. Do you know what a fowler is? A fowler is the one that sets a trap and he plays tricks. He plays as if he's in trouble. And when you come to help him, he will trap you. I don't know who is being crafty with your husband. I don't know who is being crafty with your wife. I don't know who is being crafty with you. I don't know who is being crafty with your children. I don't know who is being crafty. There's a plan to lure you, to lure your son. There's a crafty plan to bring you down. There's a plan, a crafty plan. But by the spirit, it has been Ex exhumed today. Amen. It has been exposed today. Amen. Every 
every crafty plan against you is destroyed in the name of Jesus. Every crafty plan against you is exposed and destroyed by the power of the Holy Ghost in the name of Jesus. Come on, open your mouth and begin to pray against every crafty plan, every tricky plan, every trick to bring you down, every trick to lure you into that trap, every trick to bring you into that trap so that you will not enter your new beginning. Mashika Rakatolia, any plan to to lure you so that they will kill you today is destroyed in the name of Jesus. Masakato Rabandele Ketia Rashe Ketelia Masoko de Kene Rabasa Kanteleke Rokoto Libra Dalada Rashe Ketekete Rosoko Dokodo in Jesus' name we are praying. Amen. Child of God, I saw two things. I saw somebody being lured into a car. You were lured into a car. You need to be careful. Be careful about public transport. Yes, there's somebody that I saw being lured to be kidnapped. I saw somebody's um, somebody's husband being lured into a plan. It was a plan. They just told him, come, come and do this thing. It was a crafty ploy by the enemy. But the Lord has exposed it. Amen. You will not enter their plan. Amen. You will not be trapped in their traps. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Therefore, we break that snare. Amen. We scatter the trap. Amen. And begin to escape now. In the name of Jesus Christ. We release that person who was kidnapped. There is somebody that was kidnapped. We release him. That person is coming out today, 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 today. In the name of Jesus, we make their camp too hot, too hot for them to keep that soul. In the name of Jesus, we command them to release him. Release him, let him go. Release her, let her go. Release him, let him go. Release her, let her go. Let death begin to release that person. Death, release that girl. Death, release that man. In the name of Jesus. Every plan of malaria, every plan of COVID-19, every plan of headache, body pain, to lure you into death, let it be scattered in the name of Jesus. Scatter in the name of Jesus. Scatter in the name of Jesus. Scatter in the name of Jesus. There were some people who just woke up with headache. It was a conspiracy of the wicked, of the spirit of infirmity. The spirit of infirmity conspired to bring you in so that you will die but you will not die Amen. in the name of Jesus lift up your hands say I will not die I will, not die. I will, live, I will live to declare, to declare the, goodness the, Lord the goodness of the Lord in the land of the living, of the living. thank you Abba Father thank you, Jesus. in Jesus name we are praying Amen. let's read another scripture we're going to read Jeremiah 11 9 Jeremiah 11 9 I want you to read with me. He says, again, the Lord said to me, a conspiracy exists among the men of Judah and the inhabitants of Jerusalem. There's a conspiracy among the people of your village against your husband. There's a conspiracy. I tell you the truth. Some people conspire to make him a chief. <laughs> it's, a, it's, a, it's a conspiracy to bring him into demonic kingdom. There's a conspiracy against somebody's husband. There's a conspiracy against somebody's son in the land. There's a conspiracy of the people of this nation. Your husband is in a high position, but there is a conspiracy that wants to trap him. But today we say expose and destroy. Amen. Say it three times. Say expose and destroy. Expose. Expose and destroy. Expose and destroy. Expose and destroy. In the name of Jesus. Come on, open your mouth and begin to say expose and destroy. Expose and destroy. Expose. Father, expose. In the name of Jesus. Masokoteria. Lapreketeria. Every conspiracy to bring you down. Expose. Let it be exposed. Let it be destroyed. Let it be exposed. Let it be destroyed. 
Masakara koteria katora bashakata rakatele kete. Every conspiracy to bring you down. In Jesus' name we are praying. There's a set up. You didn't do anything, but they want to bring you down. There's even a sort of or somebody's name. They went to lie against you. They have spoiled your name in the place of your business. I'm telling you, they spoiled your name in the place of your business. And that's why they have not called you yet. But after today's prayer, they will call you by Friday. Friday, tomorrow. The seven, they are going to call you. Are you ready? I want you to clap your hands and say, Father, destroy their conspiracy. Destroy their conspiracy. Destroy their conspiracy. Anyone that wants to spoil my name, anyone that wants to spoil my husband's name, my children's name, anyone that wants to spoil my brother's name, my, my wife's name, Father, let it be destroyed. Destroy, destroy, expose and destroy. Expose and destroy. Expose and destroy. In the name of Jesus Christ. Lakratose kente diato. Rabba shakata yakote. Expose and destroy. Expose and destroy every conspiracy. In the name of Jesus. Rakapa koto koraba. Lekre teke leba kondele. Rakata lama koraba santa. Lekre koto lima kandele he. In Jesus' name we are praying. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Let's read the book of Nehemiah. You know, in the book of Nehemiah, you are going to see conspiracy. <laughs> Nehemiah 4. We're going to open from 7. I'll read to 9. Nehemiah chapter 4, verse 7 to 9. Hallelujah. Is somebody being free from every conspiracy? Wherever they conspire that you will not have that child, you will have that child. Amen. Anywhere they conspire that that pregnancy is coming down, it is Amen. not coming down. In the name of Jesus, Amen. that pregnancy is not coming down. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. you will deliver that baby. Amen. Whoever is waiting for you at the verge of delivery, whoever is conspiring against you at the verge of delivery, yes. that person is wasting his time. Amen. In the name of Amen. Jesus. Amen. Let me tell you a story about myself. I remember when I had my second son, somebody asked me, a woman I respect, came to me after I had a child and I had difficulty having that child because the boy was wrapped up in his cord. I don't know who I'm talking to. It might not be a child, but you have done a project and it's the point of delivery. They're waiting for you. And when I had the child and came back home, the woman came to see me. She told me face to face that I was wondering how you will have that child. He said, I was wondering how you will have that child. There are some people who are who are waiting. They are with, they are folding their hands, watching you how you will how you will make it. Some people already know they are, they, they already plan that you will not have a child in your husband's house. Some people are folding their hands, waiting to see how you will marry. Ah, but it's an evil plan. That evil plan is destroyed today. Amen. In the name of Jesus, amen. somebody shout a bigger amen. 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 People that are planning and waiting, they will see you marry. They will see you have children. Amen. They will see you deliver that project Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. We read Nehemiah 4, 7 to 9. The Bible says, but, <laughs> but, but is that something was going on, but there was a diversion. It says, but when Sambalat and Tobiah and the Arabs and the Ammonites and the Ashdodites heard the repairing of the walls of Jerusalem was going on forward. When some people see that you are making it, that you are doing well, that that project is going on without hitches, <laughs> that the pregnancy is developing without problems. Listen to this. Say it was. It was going on forward. When they saw that you are still here in the month of August, some people are not happy to see you alive. I'm telling you. And the breaches were beginning to be closed. In other words, you are trying to finish the assignment. The year was beginning to come to an end. Eh? They were very angry. <laughs> I was not the one that said, see what Bible is saying. Sambalat and Tobiah. There are some Sambalats. There are Tobias, Arabs, Ammonites, Aldodites waiting 
They are seeing that things are moving on smooth with you, that you are getting on with your boss, that you and your husband, you people are still laughing. <laughs> the Bible says they were very, they were not just angry, they were very angry. And they all plotted together to come and fight against Jerusalem and to cause confusion in it. <laughs> and we pray to our God and set a guard as a protection against them day and night. Child of God, this is the middle of the day. It's called midday. We are taking charge of the day. We are taking charge of the night. Is somebody listening to me? Don't joke. You are, you are, you are in a very kairos time. You're in the middle of the time. Child of God, some people are angry and they are all plotting together to fight against you and to cause confusion. They want confusion in your office. They want confusion in your job. They want confusion in your health. There are some of you, you have gone to the hospital. The doctor says he doesn't know what is wrong with you. Just to put confusion. Somebody begin to pray in tongues. Come on, confuse their language. Rakataya. Confuse their confusion. Maseke take it, take it, take it. Raka pande leke tia. Rabasha kanto rokoto yeke. Razoko toko le prakande leke te. Rakante le kroto. Rajeke teke teke. Razaka daga degede. Rabasho koto lima kata ya makoro. Ike se dia koro boshete. Rakata lama. Rokoto soto rikata ya tanda. Raseke te. Razaka te. Rokoto le makaya. Rakata, ye can take a level that he confused them, that he confused them. Mashaka Rakatakara, Maseke take a level, Rokoto Koriaha, Eke, 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 Masoko Tolia, Rakatole Makora, Maseke Telema, Rokoto Lekaria, Rakato Lebahande, Leprokoto Soto, Rakatale, Rosoto, Yede de de, Rasakata, Hey, 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 hey,
the blood will speak for me in the night in the name of Jesus let the blood speak for me let the blood of Jesus speak for me let the blood of Jesus in Jesus name we are prayed amen the blood of Jesus Somebody put your hand on your head. Say the blood of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. Lead the blood of Jesus. Say the blood of Jesus. Say the blood of Jesus. The blood of the everlasting covenant. The blood that speaks better things than the blood of Abel. The blood of Jesus. Garries in me. Garries in my family. Shield me. Shield my family members. In the name of Jesus. The blood of Jesus. Rakata la bahada, maseke teliha, raseke tekele. Put a guard, a red guard, a four guard, a side guard. In the name of Jesus, the Bible says, like the mountains surround Jerusalem, so the Lord has put a guard around us. In the name of Jesus Christ, thank you, Abba Father. In Jesus' name, we are praying. In the mighty name of Jesus. Child of God, we'll go to Acts of the Apostles, chapter 23. I want, you to sh- I want you to know that from the Old Testament to the New Testament, there were conspiracies. And child of God, if you don't open your eyes, if you don't pray the way we are praying, some of you, you are going to pray for six months to come. You're going to pray for two weeks to come three hours to come every conspiracy of the devil to set accidents for you you are going to deal with it today are you listening to me you are going to deal with it today you are going to take authority over it every conspiracy the Lord said destroy Acts of the Apostles 23 we're going to read from 20 from 12 sorry 12 to 15 Acts 23 12 to 15 it says when it was day, the Jews made a plot <laughs> and bound themselves by an oath neither to eat nor to drink till they have killed Paul. There are some people that are taking evil fast for you. I had a story of a man of God who boarded a flight. He was going for a pastor's conference in one state in America. I can't remember the state now. And so the person who sat by him would not eat, would not drink, and he was just mumbling some things. So he just felt that he was a Christian. And he wanted to, you know, familiarize himself with him. So he told him, he said, hello, can I meet you? He said, yeah. He said, um, are you a Christian? I see that you're, you're fasting, you've not taken anything and all that. He said, yes, I'm fasting. But who told you everybody that fast is a Christian? <laughs> he said, I'm sorry, I'm not a Christian. Ah, the man was taken aback. And he was wondering. <laughs> and he said, yes, I'm not, I'm, I'm, no, I'm not a Christian. He said, okay, ca- may I ask who you are? And the guy said, you want to know? You want to know? Say, I'm a Satanist. Jesus, Jesus. And I'm praying against pastors. Jesus, Jesus. And praying against that conference that he's holding child of God, you don't want to know. I'm not saying be paranoid, but listen to me. There are people who have taken an oath. They neither eat nor drink anything until they have killed you. Until they have killed your child. Until they have killed your project. Until they have killed the works of your hands. There are people who have made a vow. They have bound themselves together. Ah, let me keep reading. It says, there were more than 40 who made this conspiracy. They went to the chief priests and elders and said, we have strictly bound ourselves by an oath to taste no food till we have killed Paul. Now, therefore, you, along with the council, give notice to the tribune to bring him down to you as though, it's another trick, as though you were going to determine his case more exactly and we are ready to kill him before he comes near. Child of God, there are people who have taken an oath and now they are plotting, they they have brought a crafty plan, they have set up a crafty plan with the chief priest, 
that he should trickily bring Saul. Paul say trickily bring him as though you want to make a judgment, but we are going to kill him. Child of God, I don't know. There are some of you, you are holding the letter that will kill you. You are the one carrying the letter that they said will kill you. But today you are going to open your mouth and you are going to say, anyone who has bound himself, who anyone who has taken an oath to kill me, anyone who has taken an oath to kill my husband, to kill my family, today we destroy. In the name of Jesus, Masakataraba, come and begin to destroy every conspiracy, every evil conspiracy against my life. Let it be destroyed. Any evil conspiracy against my father's life, my mother's life, my brother's life, my sister's life, every conspiracy against our family so that we will receive death. Oh, Mashaka Rakate, Rabaso Kotolia, Rakande Lekete, Robosh Kata, Rasekete, any conspiracy. Let it be destroyed. Let it be destroyed. Let every conspiracy be destroyed. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, we destroy every conspiracy. La bragode, la frekete, mashaka lekrepo, sakata le makonde riata la, sokote riakata, mashiga dalama, rokote sketelege, radole makataya baha. Any conspiracy to bring me down. Any conspiracy to shut my mouth. Any conspiracy to make sure I don't win that case. Any conspiracy in the court against you. Any conspiracy in the courthouse. Mashika rakatose. Rakatole makaya dahata. Raketele makora bashata kaya. In Jesus name we are praying. You know, like, you know, we have had so many testimonies, I can't even catch up. You know, there was this lady, whilst we were praying on Thursday like this, we talked about a court case. She said they were in court. She came out to pray that prayer. By the time she went, he said there was confusion between the lawyers. She said, I had mentioned it, that I see some people gathering like lawyers. And they were, they were, they were, they were, they were, you know, confused. May the Lord confuse your conspirators Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. Like the Tower of Babel, let their language become Babel. Amen. Let their language not agree. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. They will not agree again. Let another person say something else. Another person say something else. In the name of Jesus, Amen. we cancel their plans. Hey, oh, their projections are brought down. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. We're going to read again Jeremiah, um, Revelations 20, 1 to 15. I'm going to read very fast. Then we'll start praying. Then I saw an angel coming down from heaven. Revelations 15. And 20, sorry, 1 to 15. Then I saw an angel coming down from heaven, holding in his hand the key of the bottomless pit and a great chain. And he sees the dragon, the ancient serpent, who is devil and Satan, and bound him for a thousand years and threw him into the pit and shut it and sealed it up, sealed it over him so that he might not deceive the nations any longer until the thousand years were ended. After that, he must be released for a little while. Then I saw thrones and seated on them were those to whom the authority to judge was committed. Also, I saw the souls of those who had been beheaded for the testimony of Jesus and for the word of God, and those who had not worshipped the beast or its image and had not deceived its, received its mark on their forehead or on their hands. They came to life and reigned with Christ for a thousand years, and the rest of the dead did not come to life until the thousand years were ended this is the first revelation i want to read i want to read another scripture again because you see the one who was conspiring against you is caught you are going to arrest him first of all chain him and throw him into the bottomless pit Amen. in the name of jesus Amen. i want you to open your mouth and clap your hands and say we arrest you we arrest every conspirator begin to arrest every conspirator 
We are arrest you. We throw you into the bottomless pit. We throw you into the bottomless pit. Mashaka raka tekenebo. Rakadele poko rika taya bahata. Let the angel of the Lord arrest him. Let the angel of the Lord throw him into that bottomless pit. In the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Ghost, Rakata Rakata Rika Tayaha. In Jesus' name we are praying. Amen. You know, I saw a funny thing. There's a woman here that is watching. I saw that the people who were giving your son drugs were arrested. It's so it's so it's so clear. I saw that the people who were supplying your son drugs, luring him, they were arrested. And may they be arrested Amen. in the name of Jesus. Amen. Any wicked one, any devilish character, satanic person that is plotting to take your children bound, that is plotting to take your son into bondage, that is plotting to destroy your marriage, any unfriendly friend around you, hanging around your husband, any unfriendly friend that is hanging around your wife, Hanging around your sister, your brother. Let them be arrested in the name of Jesus. Every unfriendly friend. Everyone that laughs with you. And yet is against you. Rasekete In Jesus' name we are praying. I just saw something in an office. You are two friends. But one, your friend goes back to the, your boss to tell your boss evil things about you. But today it has been exposed. I don't, I, I, don't, I don't like preaching these kind of things. But the Lord showed me now. I'm telling you so that you don't have problems with your friend. There is an unfriendly friend around you. There's an unfriendly friend around you that is going to report the things you discuss with her. The things you discuss with him. There's an unfriendly friend around you let the Lord put a, a, a separation between you in the name of Jesus let the angel of the Lord arrest him let the angel of the Lord put chains on his hand put chains on his leg in the name of Jesus let that unfriendly friend around you be taken away in the name of Jesus let that unfriendly friend around your husband be exposed and taken away in the name of Jesus Amen in Jesus name we are praying Amen. child of God we are going to read Jeremiah 18 18 it says then they said come let us make plots against Jerusalem this one is your father's name your family name that they put there they put your family name come let us make plots against this family for the law shall not perish from the priests, nor counsel from the wise, nor the wise from the prophet. Let us strike him with a tongue. Are you seeing what they want to strike you with? Let us not pay attention to any of his words. Child of God, see what this one is saying. They want to use tongue to fight you. They want to make your words rubbish. When you make a suggestion, it's just rubbish. When you are talking, people are not hearing. There's somebody, you are in ministry. You say very right things. You preach very right words. You do very good pictures. You do very good things. Your business is good. Yet, nobody listens to you. Your, your, the people that follow you are just few. Child of God, long time ago, I remember my parents said something. They told us something. Somebody told us something. I think they had a shop. And in the night, somebody came and sprayed something there. No customer came that day until they prayed like this. Child of God, I'm watching somebody. You have a shop. And you need to drive traffic there. Let me tell you something. It's not about... It's not about what you are selling they just want to frustrate you it's not about what you are selling they want to frustrate you listen to the scripture again he said they say come let us make plots against this person for the law shall not perish from the priest nor cancel from the wise 
nor the word from the prophets. Come, let us strike him with the tongue. They saw that they could not get you in the other way. But he said, come, let us use the tongue now and strike him. Let us not pay attention to any of his words. We are going to pray. Let my words make waves. Let my market, let my, the things I'm selling begin to make waves. Let God himself begin to announce me. Let God himself begin to bring customers in the name of Jesus. Let the angels in charge of advertisement begin to advertise you. Begin to advertise your name. Begin to advertise your church. Begin to advertise your ministry. Begin to advertise the things you do. In the name of Jesus, we nullify what they have said in the, in the, in the dark. We nullify what they have said. Every attack of tongue, anyone that is using tongue to attack you, to attack your credibility. Eh, masuka taya karakate, roko ponde leke taya ha. Somebody pray like never before. Mashika rakatelewa, rapaso kotolima karadahata. In Jesus' name we are praying. Amen. There's somebody I just saw. This has been your problem. This has been your problem. They attacked you with the tongue. They saw that they could not get you in any other way. So they went to attack you with the tongue. And they now spoke against your own tongue. That whatever you say, let them not hear you. That whatever you say, let them not hear you. You have not seen this thing before. I have seen it before. Child of God, I have seen it before. I don't know about you. Today you are going to pray like never before. Because I don't like the way you are praying. You need to pray again. You need to pray. Anyone that has gone to spoil your name or made your words rubbish before your benefactors, before your destiny helpers, the people who are supposed to come and patronize you, who are supposed to come and buy from you. Ah, they are not hearing what you are saying. Now listen to me before you start praying. Listen to me. The Lord just told me something. He said, as you finish praying, there are some people who are going to call you. You will be shocked and they will ask you, what did you say? What did you say this product is about? What did you say this is about? Yes. What is that thing you say you are selling? They will ask you again, hey, what do you say you wanted to do? Yes. There is a particular person that is going to call somebody here today. Yes, he's going to call you and he will say, I want to invest in that business. I want to invest in that ministry. I want to, I want to give you a land. There's a land coming for somebody. There's a support coming for somebody. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Every attack of the tongue against my ministry. Every attack on my marriage. Every attack on my on my business. Every attack. Masekete lepra, rakatala masekete, rosoko tele makayante, la brakanda la kateya, razekete kete, razaka takata, rosoko tele makaya dakata. Father, we come against the attack. We silence the attack. We shut them up. We shut them up. We shut them up. We shut them up. In Jesus' name, we are praying. Of God, listen to me. I just saw something very clearly. There's somebody, it's like you will take the drugs and it won't work. That's what they say. Let us not pay attention to any of his words. Let the drugs not work for him. Let that treatment not work for him. There's somebody you have been on malaria treatment for a long time and you are wondering, is it not working? But today, I stand as a prophet of the Most High God and I decree that that medicine will begin to work. Before the end of today, you will start sweating and you will feel better in the name of Jesus. Every sickness in your body, we command it to go now in the name of Jesus. Lose your hold over her. Lose your hold over him. In the name of Jesus. Your mind has gone everywhere. You are beginning, you're beginning to think that there's something else. There's not something else. There's been a conspiracy. It's conspiracy, sorry, against you. Every conspiracy against your health. Every conspiracy against your business, against your relationship. Today, by the power of the Holy Ghost, we bring it down, we scatter it in the name of Jesus. Let it be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Asakata Yaba. Child of God, we are rounding off. Masoko leba karaba shende. Leprokoto soto koroboshende gelia. 
la prokoto soto korobo sete kele bash le prakata ya mahanda one more scripture and then we round off the bible says so shall my word isaiah 55 11 so shall my word be that goes out from my mouth it shall not return to me empty but it shall accomplish that which i propose and shall succeed in the thing for which i sent it child of god every prayer you have prayed today is going to accomplish great things Amen. in the name of Jesus Amen. Christ of Nazareth. I want you to begin to speak the word of God concerning you. Amen. I want you to go ahead and say, He that dwells in the secret place of the Most High shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. I am covered by the blood of Jesus. No weapon formed against me shall prosper. Somebody open your mouth. He said, They shall surely gather together, but not by me. He said, They shall fall for my sake. They will gather in one way, they will scatter in seven years. Come on, let the word of God begin to go ahead of you. Rakatole Makande I am healed by the stripes of Jesus. I am healed by the stripes of Jesus. Oh, will I be prayed? Will I come to the place of delivery and not deliver? I will deliver in the name of Jesus Christ. The Bible says, None shall be barren. He said, None shall seek her mate. None shall seek her mate. Your husband is coming. Your wife is coming. Masha Karaka Tele Bahaya. You shall not be barren. Somebody speak. Come on, go ahead and begin to speak the word of God. Rakateleke Gros Katala Bakora Bashanta. Le proconde leke riata la rase kete 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 kete. Maleke teke le makora bashata kariete le la praconte le prakote le makora bashika takaya and lekete. Li prakata la baha. Lift up your hands and begin to thank him. Ah, the Lord has released me. I am free. I am free. Somebody say I'm free. I'm not disadvantaged. In the name of Jesus. Every conspiracy against that job, let it be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Every conspiracy against your promotion, let it be destroyed. Every conspiracy against your children, let it be destroyed. Every conspiracy against my marriage, against my husband, against my wife, let it be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Every conspiracy, let it be destroyed. Anyone that is speaking against you, let his tongue cleave to the roof of his mouth. In the name of Jesus, we silence that one that is speaking contrary to what God has said concerning you. In the name of Jesus, I feel the anointing so strong. Lift up your hands wherever you are. Ila la la bosha, iye kele kataya manondo. I feel the power of God. There's a wave of the Spirit, a supply of the Spirit. Iyo kolo bosho. Yes, write your prayer points. Write your prayer points. Iye kele manono moshi kele bosho. Iya kala bosho tole mananosa. Come on, go ahead and write your prayer points. Begin to write your prayer points. Rakata kale ketele makura bashide gede bos soto lobos. As I speak in tongues over those prayer points, they begin to turn to testimonies. Let your prayer point become a testimony. Iko lobo bobo bobo shakata yande. Rakata le kere boso kotori pakarata tele ketosa. Makata la makote ni makarate gele gebosha. Hey! There's a wave of glory. There's a wave of glory. Kala patoria, kala masopatoria, masha katale mokoro bosoto koro do 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 do. Iye kele ketele makoro mashanda. Iko lo bosoto tele makaya na 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 na. Iye kele bosoto tele makora masha kataya manono. La prakata la makora mashika ragade legete gele. Rakata la makora mashika na na na. Regete le prokoto ni makaya na na no sekele. Hey, masoko to the bo 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 bo. Yakata le kale kari kata le 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 kete kali poko ramata la. Hey, kala masoko te le 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 le. Holy Ghost, have your way. Ah, daddy, preach on this prayer point. Preach on this prayer point. Masha kate le 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 bo shaka ta ya makora masata 
You know, I just got a word for somebody. The Lord said, I should say to you, go and meet your boss. Buy him a gift. Go and give him. That's it. That's your breakthrough. It doesn't matter whether it's a wicked boss who has dealt with you. Buy him a gift. Go and give him. You are for the war. Just like Abigail went to David and she packed all those things. Because there's actually a conspiracy against you. There's a conspiracy. Even in that relationship, there's a conspiracy. You're supposed to be booted out of that relationship. Some of you, it's your mother-in-law. Go and buy her a gift quickly. And that's the truth. By the time you buy that gift and drop it, hey, kalabalabalabahota. It's not like you don't know what to answer. But that is a battle that you will win. Definitely. Just like Esther did. The Bible says Esther, when he was offered her to the half of her king, the kingdom, he said, no, let me give you something that you like. Let me make you a dinner. Let me set before you a banquet and come with your enemy. That's my enemy. Come with him. Man. Child of God, I don't know who I'm talking to. It might look like a stupid thing to do. But God just gave a word for the end of that conspiracy. Get the head man of that place. Package something and go and give him. <laughs> you remove the weapon from his hand. His weapon becomes useless. Lift up your hands. Because the wave of glory is coming. That is the power of God. Ha, I feel the anointing so strong. Let the anointing begin to go ahead of somebody. The anointing of God is going ahead of you right now. Doing strange things. Strange things. Yes, yes, that's it. Strange things are happening. Hey, Kalabos. I feel the anointing so strong. You do mighty things. You do glorious things. You're a faithful God. Awesome is your name. You do mighty things. You do glorious things. You're a faithful God. Awesome is your name. Oh, Jesus. God is doing mighty things. I'm telling you. Creator of the universe, what can you do? What can you do, Jesus? Name above every other name. What can you change? What can you change? Yeah, we're 
Holy Communion. Take your bread. For the next 25 days of August, the Lord will see you through. May this communion make a way for you. May this communion shut the mouth of your conspirators in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Let this communion silence the voice of the wicked over you. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. By this communion, the mouth of the wicked over you is shut. Thank you, Abba Father. Blessed be your holy name forever. Go ahead and partake. Can you take the blood? Speak over the blood. Father, we thank you for the blood of Jesus. By this blood, we are covered. We lift it above our heads and we declare silence over the enemy. It is the blood that silences. It is the blood that speaks for us. Today, the blood is going to speak for somebody. Better things than the voice of conspirators. In the name of Jesus. Now, let me say this. Listen to this. It doesn't matter whether they have something good against you. Whether it was something you did legally. But there is something in this blood that can silence every legality against you. The Bible says he will even save the ones that were legally taken. Ah, Masukata Yabahata. Whether you were legally taken, whether it was right for them to deal with you, but by this blood, they will not deal with you again. By this blood, it will weaken their points. It will weaken their evidence. Let this blood take away the evidence from their hands. In the name of Jesus, every evidence against you, we silence it. In the name of Jesus, every evidence that is speaking against you. Yes, it might be that you have had a bad character. It might be that something is against you. But by this blood, let the blood speak better things. Let the blood speak better things. Let the blood speak better things. Go ahead and partake. In Jesus' name. Continue to share the broadcast. Continue to invite somebody to watch because there is something for somebody. God bless you. Have a nice day. Hey, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Our God is good all the time. I hope you were blessed today. Today was awesome. I know that so many people got so many miracles. My prayer for you is that your miracle will be permanent in the name of jesus and i come against any reprisal attack in the name of jesus no reprisal attack in the name of jesus so go and enjoy your testimony go and enjoy your new life i believe that you will show god that you love him in everything that you do go ahead and share the video keep sharing the video i want to say thank you to those who have been sharing thank you for sharing Thank you for what you do. Thank you for telling your friends. Go ahead and announce the gospel. Go ahead and make somebody watch the video. God bless you. I see some of you type people's names. Go ahead and type somebody's name in that video. Well, on YouTube, you can go to YouTube. You're going to find us. God bless you. Love you. Bye.